Good morning students I hope you all are fine and today we are going to revise a new lesson of science that is measurement and our first topic is what is measurement the method by which we find out the size or amount of something is called measurement we keep track of our time with the help of a clock see what's it saying it's saying that to measure the size or amount is known as measurement and how we do uh, how do we measure time with the help of a clock like if you can see the clock nearby you there must be some timing in it like 11 o'clock 12 o'clock so this is how we are measuring time with the help of a clock in our daily life we need to measure various things like we need to measure how heavy an object is like you need to measure what's your weight what's your body weight the amount of an object means how much sugar is present in that box how long and short an object is for example we need to measure the amount of sugar we want to add a glass of milk like daily at night or in the morning you need to measure one spoon sugar or two spoon sugar okay we need to measure our total body length to know how tall we are growing every month next point we also need to know how far or near an object is for this we measure the distance of an object from a certain place see let me show you some pictures see this is the weighing machine that how you can measure your weight many of you must have tried okay so the weight has been shown 48.5 so this is how we are measuring it and unit we will discuss in our next topic see this is the measuring instrument of sugar that how much amount of sugar is present in that polythene 1 kg you need 2 kg you need so this is the measuring instrument of that sugar amount of sugar see this is infrared thermometer and what's its use it measures your body temperature in degree celsius or degree fahrenheit so units are coming in our next topic in our next video so see students in earlier times people kept track of time by observing the movement of sun moon and heavenly objects heavenly bodies like your grandma grandpa used to measure time with the help of the movement of sun to measure the length of different things they used their hand span like this boy is showing the measuring the length of the table with the help of hand span by using its by using his hand next is c food span with the help of food span with the help of food they used to measure the length of an object and yeah one more thing cubit with the help of cubit they used to measure the length of the different things but these all are incorrect way in accurate way to measure because can you guess why because it is just because the size of body parts differs from person to person like everything is different in size so if you are using your hands to measure then different time you will get the different answers like if a same table is measured by three different people then three different answers will come so they need a proper instrument a proper machines proper technique to measure different kinds of object so this will be uh, shared in the next video till that you can listen this only take care